Hey everybody, it's Graphic Kitty, and I have a haul to share with you that I bought from, it's called Unique, what is it called? Sorry, I gotta remember the name of the company. Unique, that is the name of the company. It's a, re it's a scrapbooking store and a retreat online. I will leave the link to their website in the description box, but I will show you what I found, and I am just like over the moon. <laughs> so... Let me show you. Now, you all know that my favorite company is Graphic 45. So, I did get this. And the it wasn't too bad uh, of a price. I got free shipping. So, I had it sent to a friend. And they, they lived in uh, Ontario, so they got it for me. Which I can't thank them enough. Saved me some money on shipping. But the first thing I got was this. The Ephemera Queen. From Graphic 45. And this is awesome. I love this. It, I, I mean, Graphic 45 is my all-time favorite um, company. And... This is the first page. It's awesome. And you get three sheets of each. It is double sided. So that's the first page. Just gonna let you see that. And you get three sheets of each. And so the other page is this one. And that's the back is yellow. Let's see. I don't know. It's not coming in very quick. Good. But once again, my lighting is not the best. I did buy a light ring, but I don't have. Can't set it up just yet. <laughs> this is the other sheet. And the back has an actual pattern on it this time because the other side did have a pattern too but this one is like oops this beautiful blue kind of vintagey look i don't know if this will make a difference maybe well what do you know that helped <laughs> so and then you have the small cut of hearts page the ephemeras The back is only this little black, black and white polka dots on it. And then this one is a flower page. Let's see. How can I do this? There. This is not really doing it justice for the colors. But you know how Graphic 45 is kind of muted. This is the green on the back of that one. Okay. Darn it. This one I think I have it good. The light just the cloud the cloud. The sun Oi, the clouds come out. <laughs> oh, okay, I got going the wrong way. Oh, and here's the one with the more little cut aparts. Little cards. I like them. I think they're great. I am on the lookout for the under the sea voyage one I think it is or I'd have to go look it up again it's like a steampunk mermaid one. Oh my god I'm sorry I ever missed that I didn't even realize they had stamps out or anything for that those were like totally amazing I just love it so I'm trying to find that paper collection as well so far I haven't had any luck as usual I don't think these these guys didn't have it they had other sets but they didn't have that one And on the back is just, it's just stripes, blue stripes. Yeah, I think that's the spot. <laughs> then we have this thing of ephemera as well. Cut apart. Love it. And on the back is just a nice uh, pattern. 
of pink roses. And then the best part is they also always include something like this, like a template um, in, in their cardboard. And because this is actually pretty good, I usually use the covers and stuff, and I cut out all the little pieces up here and use them as chipboard pieces. So I got that one. And of course, I'm going to save my favorite. I did get, now this is weird because I didn't realize I had ordered just, <laughs> just one. <laughs> but I ordered just one of these cut apart sheets for Halloween. <laughs> I think I was looking at it and thought, well, maybe I'll get one. So I put it there and then forgot to promptly take it out. And then on the back is just a bunch of little eyes. But the cut aparts are cute. And I did buy a couple of sheets of Stamperia. I didn't particularly like the entire collection, but I like certain pieces. So I got this one, which is, what's it? I don't even think it has names. Not like these, most of them do. And this is the back, very muted. I also got this one, which was the cut aparts. It's very nice and will match my stamps that I got from Allie. Not as thick as um, Graphic 45, but it's still good. Then there's this one. And this is the back. And these ones, the music ones, are from the same collection. I think it was a ballet one or something or something like that for Santeria. Love the vintage roses on this one. Here's the back. Again, it's all muted browns and soft, soft brown, soft turquoise. And this one I just think is awesome. Look at this. I love that. I'm going to have to make a 12 by 12 album. So that I don't have to cut her up <laughs> and keep, I can keep her full things if I do a 12 by 12 album. And on the back it's just, and here comes the dilemma sometimes is when you have the double sided paper, it's like, ah, oh, like both sides. How do I use both sides of the paper? Well, usually you buy two, but for a dollar 80 a sheet, I don't think I'm going to buy two. <laughs> and again, we have some journaling cards. Here, which I like to use in my albums for people to put pictures and to do their journaling on. Here is the last one of this one and it is for the, it's the journaling cards again and it's the music one. But it's so pretty. I mean really, this is pretty. But like I said, it's not as, not as dirty as the as the graphic 45 but hey it's beautiful and I will keep it so there was a special they had on the goddess collection from I from graphic 45 and so you got a few sheets but you didn't know what you were gonna get they were supposed to they were supposed to be random so this one is happiness blossoms from the garden goddess collection so this is what it looks like. This is the back side, which is more pink in the green kind. This is more of a tony yellowish color. And you got two of I got two of those. Then there's this one, which is called Love Grown Here. It says beauty blossoms from inside. Very pretty. Love this paper. Beautiful yellows and greens. This lately I've been into the yellows and greens. I really like them and they sent me two sheets of those. This is the other sheet, the 12 by 12. It says Garden Goddess. That's the name of this sheet. But it's so pretty. These ones are the ones I kind of like to make pocket letters with and then this, you know, then you can have the full sheet in there and on the back it's just a green flowers. I've got two of those. And they sent me two of these um, 
find from within, which is the ephemera cards, which you cut up. So they are just so pretty. Look at her. Pretty. And it's pink on the back with the flowers and swirls. And this one has two. I swear they almost gave me the entire collection and it was only $8.99. That's what I remember. And here's another one. I really love this collection. Mind you, I like anything from Graphic 45. I don't have, but I do have to say, I'm not big on their Christmas ones. But then again, it's Christmas. So, I mean, I'm not a big Christmas fan. They sent me three of these ones. Oh, and they sent me an extra. That's the first one I showed you. I got three of those, I guess. And then there's this one, which is Fields of Flowers. And it's just pink with flowers. And then it's just green print on the back. We got two of those. Then we have the borders, which is called Seeds of Kindness. And so they're just borders, and you can cut them across, cut them across to use as decorations and stuff. And you got the little postage stamps here. Love it. So that's that one. Now my all-time favorite thing that I got from them was. Sorry, you gotta do something first. <laughs> Can't gotta hide the evidence. No, just kidding. <laughs> There is this. Oh my god, it's the Midnight Tales from Graphic 45. It is their newest Halloween line. I am so happy with this. And look at the back. Even the back of the pad has stuff. So I'm gonna share with you and look in the cover here. It has tag uh, templates and stuff. So pretty cool. This is the first page. And again, like I said, you get three, just like on the back of the cover that's all spider webs. This is so pretty. I mean, this picture doesn't do it justice. It is so nicely vibrant with the orange and the green and the black. I just love it. On the back of that one is just polka dots, which will make your eyes go kind of wonky. <laughs> then we have these ones, which are journaling cards in here. Like, I just, it's awesome. I love these. These are too cute. And on the back of this one, again, with the green and the orange. Beautiful. Here is the other page. That, it's very busy. says here's magic in the air hocus pocus trick or treat is what it says on there and then on the back it's just a bright orange this one is has little fairy goblins I guess I don't know and witches and all in there and it's just black and orange and on the back is just stripes then there's this one which is a purple flower with spiders and oranges on the orange background. And on the back of this one is a purple. And then on this one, it's like the fairy little goblins. Because they don't look like your traditional fairies. <laughs> They're kind of funny looking. I don't know if that'll come in or not really pretty and on the back of that one is all the words hocus pocus trick-or-treat midnight tales and then this one which is the the cut aparts again with this little postage stamps little journaling cards just so pretty and on the back of this one it's like an ombre effect Let's just do this one. So it starts off with orange and black cats, goes to purple and black cats, kind of fades in and out. I 
am so happy that I got this. So I got that one. I got two. And then, my friends, I got the 12 by 12s as well. So, once again, we must hide the evidence. <laughs> I'm kidding. I just don't like the stickers on these things. So we got those. And in this one, in the 12 by 12, like this, you get the same pictures and every, everything, the same same paper, but you get stickers in this as well. So I'll show you the stickers. It's uh, two sheets of uh, 6 by 12. So this is the first set of stickers. Love that witch. So cute. And the black cats. And there's this one looks like a regular little fairy. But these little guys right here, not so much the little I think they're more like little hobgoblins and the goblins than anything. And then there and this has borders as well on here. And it has corners and tags. There's corners. There's the borders across the bottom. And then there's this one with more tags. Took me a while to find this. And when I went on one time, they didn't, it wasn't displaying, it wasn't showing as it was, as if they were run out. Maybe they got some again when I went in the second time. But yeah, and I want to thank my friend Rula who is Midnight Crafting with Rula for giving me the address for this. Really appreciate it, Rula. Thank you so much. So, yeah, I that's everything I got from their store. Could not be happier because, I mean, it's so awesome. But thank you all for watching. I appreciate it. Thank you for your support. Yeah. If you like this video, please leave me a thumbs up. Don't forget to be happy and crafty, and I'll talk to y'all later. Bye!